Just a little more than seven. 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 <laughs> Perfect. World record holder Carlos Sai just turned out two time, two time concurrently. World record holder Carlos Sai just turned out Bulgarian 89, and uh, I asked him what he was going to do, and he said snatch, clean and jerk, pull, squat, and he did snatch, clean and jerk, pull, squat. So he snatched. He said that he was going to do around 160 kilos, and then next thing we know, 165 was loaded. And I think he got carried away, got a little bit silly billy with it, and hit 170 kilos in the snatch. He was wearing straps, but it looked very, very good, looked very strong. Then in the clean and jerk, we noticed that he wasn't wearing any knee sleeves, uh, but even so, he built up. 170, 190, 200. Then his coach said no, and he said yes. So they sort of met in the middle ground. He did 205. Jock looks very, very strong. Uh, so he, he's clearly in good shape now. He actually asked if we, have, if we have any knee sleeves. Fortunately, we do. We have spares with us. So we're going to lend him a pair, maybe loan him. We might have to get him. No, we'll, we'll give him a pair of weightlifting house knee sleeves. Uh, so hopefully he sets a world record in them, which would be kind of cool. Uh, but we'll give him those tomorrow. And then he did some pulls, uh, squats. What did he get up to? I didn't... 250 for four. 250 for a set of four. I did see him grinding the hell out of the last rep, which I just, you have to wonder, like, why would you do that when you're so close to competition? Grind it. Could you, could you have just done three? But nonetheless, we then hung out with him and uh, Alexi Trocti. We did the grip test and uh, he got 78 kilos, so I came in, I went for the win, I didn't make it, I got 69, and then Max came in and beat me with 70.4. <sighs> I know, I can believe it. Um, so he's, he's got a decent grip, but then Turok Alexi did it, and he has like 107, and then Gore did 113, which is ridiculous. We should also mention the fact that the Armenians are training, Brazdat Lalian, clean and jerk 230 kilos, which is big, uh, Simon Martirosian snatched 180 and the most impressive thing was the fact that we saw Gormanassian, Bahrainian athlete, he turned up and uh, he hang snatched uh, 200 kilos which is absolutely ridiculous. Hey Sergey. What's up? What was the most impressive thing we saw today? Was it the 200 hang snatch or the 170.205 from Carlos? I would say the most, impre all, all the 69 kilo the most impressive was how tight was Simon Martirassian during the warm-up. So his shoulders was like this. But then after 180 it became a little bit better. Well he missed it on his first yeah. attempt because he was too tight yeah, and yeah. then gradually it got further back. So yeah. Mobility is the king. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> anyway, so a very, very cool uh, session there. But I think we're going to head back and crack on some edits and then we've got to move over and do some commentary because it's uh, some big sessions tonight. Okay, so very quickly before we get on to the later sessions, just I remembered when Gore was doing that 200 kilo hang snatch, he then loaded 210 kilos and I ran over because I wanted to get it. And uh, his coach said, no, 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 it's, it's, a, it's a pull, it's a pull. And then he looked at me and he said, it's 210, he's no lasher. And I was like, wow, it's so harsh. I mean, of course he's no lasher, but still, to refer to an athlete like that who competes against lasher, I thought was funny. So later on, we finally got to see Marin Robu uh, from Moldova, Stanky Leg Robu himself, uh, who's now moved up to that 89 kilo category. And Nick, who was here filming, said that he looked, um, he looked fluffy. Like, you know, when Carlos has moved up to 89, he's done it so slowly, and it's just muscle mass. With Robu, it's like he's done it all in about four months, and it's like all fat mass. Uh, but his bottom position has improved, it looks like. In the snatch, he's catching things a little bit more evenly balanced in the legs. Like, he's not got one leg coming in as much. Uh, he worked up to 150 kilos in the snatch. I think he actually missed 160 kilos, which is surprising. But, you know, maybe he just got off a flight or something like that, I don't know. And then he worked up to 190 kilos. The 190 looked pretty good, actually, to be fair. I, I think finally, if we're lucky, we might see him crack over 200. Uh, trading alongside him was Daniela German from Sweden. Nothing particularly heavy, maybe 85, 100, something like that. And then we turned up today and it was just a full training hall. And the most exciting thing was the fact that Nina was on this platform right there and Carlos was just there. And they were watching each other the whole time. So 
I wasn't aware of it until someone else told me, but every time Carlos did a lift, Nina would watch and vice versa. Even to the point where Nina was doing, working up really heavy in the snatch pulls and he got up to 200 kilos and 210 kilos. At the end of Carlos's workout, penultimate exercise, he started doing snatch pulls and his coach just said, no, no, we're not doing snatch pulls. It's not on the program today because they're two days out. And he said, no, I'm doing snatch pulls because Nino did snatch pulls, which I thought was really interesting. They're like, I don't think he was doing it to show Nino that he could make it look quicker and faster, which I think he did. Uh, but I think it was more like, I need to show myself that like, I make 200 look quicker than that. And I think, and I think he did. Uh, but he worked up first off in the front squat, uh, up to 220 for a triple, 230 for a double. This is one day after 172.05 and the 250 before. It was at that point that we, we turned up, so we gave him the knee sleeves. He actually, I brought in large, extra large, extra extra large because I wear a large and I was like I know he's a little bit shorter than me but he's obviously got bigger legs than me and he was like oh I need a medium and I was like just try on the large like I'm sure the large is gonna be fine and uh, and then he really liked the large so he's now wearing the large weightlifting house knee sleeves which is cool I'll put a link to those down below if you want to get them uh, and he started muscle muscle snatching up to 100 kilos which is cool looked very easy then power snatching 120 straight to 140 and then he loaded 150 he power snatched it and then Having not done this at all, he just lowered it and did a hang power snatch, which I thought was just classic him. Uh, then clean and jerk. No, that's when he then did the heavy snatch, pulls up to 210, just to do what Carlos did, uh, Nino had done. And then he did power clean and power jerks up to 170, I think, something like that. Maybe he did 180, I can't quite remember. And that was it. Uh, at the same time, all the Italians were training, a lot of bodybuilding, so we saw uh, Julian Perry was doing dips and rows. Uh, Sergio Macida was on this platform doing presses and, and close grip with a weight on his back, sort of like tricep press-ups. Um, all of them were training. Oh, we even saw Lucrezia Magistris who bombed out yesterday. She just hit a 115 cleaner jerk just to prove that she was up there if she'd have made some snatches, which she didn't. Uh, so all in all, good session. Very quiet now, so hopefully we can get some editing done, maybe we're training ourselves, and then we'll crack on with some more filming. Okay, so something cool. We spoke with Carlos. Uh, and we asked him what are his best snatch and clean and jerk numbers in training recently and he told us and they are equal to a couple of historic numbers so if you're aware of like the previous weight categories the 85s and the 94s those are the clues so his best snatch 187 kilos and his best clean and jerk 233 kilos so i think it's safe to say he's in pretty good shape he then told us well you don't know this yet nick we were out at dinner yesterday with sergey putsov and sergey spoke to him he told Sergey that he hang snatched 193 kilos. <laughs> um, so that's the kind of shape that Carlos is bringing for this competition. So that 187, 233. I mean, that's like Ilya numbers and Sarab numbers. And then that's like Ribikov in the snatch. So who knows what he's going to do come competition day. But uh, if you tune in at tv.wedifhouse.com, you'll be able to find out.